Hi, it's Alex. Today I want to talk about people making negative comments about other people's appearance or way of dress, and why I don't like this. We've all heard lots of comments like this. Uh, a typical example of them is like, oh, she should not be wearing that, or like, oh my god, look at that guy's shirt, it looks so terrible, or whatever. Like, people make negative comments about other people's bodies, too. I think usually people don't make these sorts of comments directly to other people. Sometimes they do, I think that's exceptionally rude. But um, usually it's just like chatter kind of like from a distance. It's like a group of people are, are watching someone else and they start making negative comments about that person. I think that even if you're not making a comment directly to another person, it can be really damaging to make these sorts of comments. And one of the ways I think about this is I like to think about whether or not your remarks are contributing to a positive or negative atmosphere as a whole. And I think this is relevant because um, I think it's related to depression. Depression is something that I have personally struggled with, and it has gotten severe at times. Like, I've struggled with feeling suicidal. And I've overcome my depression, and I've become very aware of the different influences on depression. And one thing that I became aware of is, reflecting back on my past, how many negative comments I have heard over the course of my lifetime about other people's appearance. I heard all sorts of people in my life making these comments, like both my peers, people at school close to my age, and also adults in my life, who I kind of would expect to know better than that, but honestly I think some of the adults in my life were some of the worst examples uh, when it came to making negative comments about people's appearance. And I can think of a lot of different people who have made these kinds of comments. I think that when people make a lot of negative comments, it can cause a great deal of harm. I think one aspect of it is just by focusing on negative things at all, it's kind of not a good thing. Like, think about it like this. If you're going out into the world, and say you see a bunch of people, and one of them you think looks really great, and another person you think looks really terrible, are you going to feel better if you focus on the person that looks terrible, or if you focus on the person that you think looks great? I don't know about you, but I feel like I'm just happier if I focus on things and people that I appreciate. Like, if I'm going through the day and I'm like, oh my god, that person's shoes look horrible, and like, oh, the color of that shirt, like, ugh. Like, if I'm thinking about those things, I'm not exactly going to be enjoying myself. On the other hand, if I'm going down the street and I'm like, oh my god, that guy's hat is freaking awesome. I'm going to feel pumped, I'm going to be like, heck yeah, and like, say I'm like just sitting in a coffee shop and I'm like checking out people's shoes, I'm like, oh my god, those shoes are super cute. I'm just like, heck yeah, it like makes me smile, it makes me feel good. That's how I want to go through my day. I also think that these negative comments about people's appearance can have deep and lasting effects on other people who overhear those comments. So it might not even be people that you're talking to, maybe someone's walking by and they overhear those comments. Like say you're making a comment like, oh, she should not be wearing those shorts, like she's too fat, whatever. And maybe there's someone walking by who's on the heavier side and they hear that, and it contributes to like a negative internalized self-image. And like, maybe it can contribute to people's eating disorders, things like that. Like, um, you want to think about eating disorders, I think that one of the ways that eating disorders play out and form is that there are all these little interactions coming together. These little things that people hear, and like, they get, it gets lodged in their mind. And I think that these things are toxic, these negative ideas these criticisms of people's bodies and of people's way of dressing. I think they're toxic, and I think that they have really profound negative impacts on people that can even, in some cases, be a matter of life and death. Um, I don't think I'm exaggerating by saying that. So, basically, I want to call on you all, have whatever fashion sense, whatever aesthetic sense you want, 
But if you have a lot of negative comments that are coming into your mind, um, don't express them. I'd say like try to focus on positive things. Like you'll feel better, you'll enjoy life more, and you'll be having a more positive impact on other people. I think that if you go through life and you're just like telling people what you appreciate about them, that's just a much better way to live, and I think it makes the world a better place. So I'd love to hear from you. If you have anything to add, um, please comment. And as always, I love when people share my videos. Uh, I especially think that it helps more people to be exposed to these ideas, and that's what I want. I want to change and influence our culture in positive ways. Thank you!